Peter, you can use different textures for your buildings. I'm just like, what if I love concrete, huh? What if I love concrete? Welcome back to Breadtown Square, the wonderful town created by yours truly, Pita Bread. It's actually horrible. Anyway, welcome back to the channel, guys. Today, we are going to be um, working on my first store here in Breadtown Square. So, in the last video, you guys saw me work on this blue home over here. And um, this is what it looks like. I'm just going to give one more tour real quick here. Real quick, I'm going to make this fast. So, this is what it looks like. And a couple of things were fixed here, but overall I think it turned out really nice. Um, still might make some adjustments to it or add things to it, but yeah, anyway, that is the tour of this home. I actually started a little bit working on the greenhouse, and I don't think I'm going to be doing that for a video. Maybe if we have a lot of time, we could do it for this video too, but um, I'm going to focus on the store today. But this is what the greenhouse is starting to look like. I only did a little bit of it, like I started a bit at the top floor. There's just way too many lights up here. I gotta... I just have to, like, stop. Ooh, free money! There's only three parking spots over here because I don't imagine that many people being here at once. So three is just good enough. I think I'm going to do three for every single community lot that I do. But yeah, anyway, we're going to work on our store now. And um, I think we can... Well, we'll just leave the sign like that because it is still being under construction. Um, a lot of my buildings were made out of concrete. You guys know concrete is my favorite texture. And some people are are gonna be like, why are you using concrete for every single thing? And you know, Kelly still happens to say the same thing like, Peter, you can use different textures for your buildings. I'm just like, what if I love concrete, huh? What if I love concrete? I agreed. I'm just like, okay, maybe I'm going a little bit overboard here. So I changed my uh, security area to uh, wooden, a wooden texture. And I think that's the only thing I did. Everything else is still concrete. <laughs> oh, well, it's okay. So we are going to create our store. It's going to be like a little, like, you know, dollar store or a supermarket. Like, just your local supermarket. Maybe I can make this like the farmer supermarket or something. Mm. Let's do, like, freezers right here. Um, a couple freezers here. And we'll put... Some doors down. Let's put a couple doors, like three. And then I have to separate this by putting a wall between each of these doors. And I don't know what I want to add for like actual... Should I just put in like a locker or something? Like a storage to make it look like that's a freezer? Because we know this ain't a freezer, like an actual freezer. Here. Oh, I have an idea. What if I put a painting and it had like pictures of food? <gasps> Ooh, that'd be so much better, right? You know, totally. Okay, so I think I need a skinny photo. Ooh, right here. This is it. This is perfect. Oh, this is perfect. Okay, we'll do this and we'll have pictures of food. And then I'll probably make like a photo. I'll probably, I'll probably make my own decal for this type of stuff. I don't want, oh, sticking out. That's the problem. Yeah, look out for that. You don't want it sticking through your wall. So let's put our wall back down. A wall down put our door up so then yeah that's just pictures of food here to make it actually look like there's some produce some frozen stuff in there since winter is coming i feel like making all the roof like white just to make it look like there's snow on top of it i think that would be a really cool idea oh my gosh hold on i just realized this okay so now that we have those freezers done i think we must add some more things like shelving okay don't know if I want to add that shelf. Well, I guess we can add a couple of these. Let's just add both of those. And then there will be things there. Things on there. I had to put stuff up there. Alright, I think the checkout area will be right here. So, let's just get that place down too. This. Just to give them a little bit more room to work with. So, there's that. And then we need to add in a cash register, which I think I do have. Oh wait, I think I don't have one. We need to buy one, so let's get a cash register. Handy dandy block bucks, new category. This new block bucks category, I can now find things way easier if I want to just spend block bucks. I don't think anyone's gonna buy anything here actually, but just this for role play. Some places actually do have like, you know, those beverage fridges. So I think I'll put one like right here in case they wanna 
like a little snack area you know like when you're in a walmart or a kroger's or something like you're in line the, between the aisles and stuff for checkout there's always those like snack shelves and beverage fridges for you just in case you want to grab like something last second um we obviously need like a little radio but we're not gonna spend blocks bucks of course we're gonna get one from the electronics area we still have a lot to do with our supermarket, so this is not done nearly done yet. What should they sit in? Should they sit in a comfy office chair? Sure, why not? Why not? Why the heck not? <laughs> this is silly. Alright, and then I'm gonna add some Christmas lights back here because... Festive! It's almost Christmas! Yes. And there we go, that looks beautiful. Beautiful. Not beautiful. Um, maybe this could be like a... Uh, what gonna call it? A... 7-eleven or a walgreens or something maybe walgreens so we're gonna probably add like you know toothbrush stuff like toothbrush sets in case they want to you know get a toothbrush they're just moving into the town they need some like they need a they just need a toothbrush you know hygienic stuff uh let's get some towels too maybe they could purchase some towels they like I don't know. Green, you have the choice of green or polka dots. That's your choice. Or blue. <gasps> Let's make it blue. Ooh, blue or polka dots. That's your choice now. Maybe we can put a couple of freezers here too or something. We can put like two freezers here. Oh, get some soap too. Let's add some soaps on the top of this shelf. Let's just add a bunch of soap. So there's soaps, hairbrushes, towels, toothbrushes for you to get ready into the town. You know, just get yourself situated if you need any of those. And there's bowls of fruit that are not centered. Oh my god, some people are going to get triggered. The grid actually helps you center things. Yeah, look at that. See, that's good. So I'll use that from now on. I want to add like those, um, those table things where you can like add fruits and stuff onto. <laughs> okay, I've decided to put the fresh produce on like this table here. Ooh, I can sell pies. I can sell food here, like just flat out food. We'll just pretend like it's packaged, right? Okay, I'll, okay, I'm gonna save. You know what? I'm gonna save this, um, these shelves for actual food that I will sell, so they can actually just buy it. So it'll probably be like three dollars or something. I don't know, but these are the essentials. These are gonna be actual food. Uh, I'm gonna put a sign up here too. Let's put one. Ooh, not like that. How about... Yeah, this is looking fancy. Fancy, fancy. What a great store. Also, 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 there's the automatic door sensor. So we don't have to, like, you know, go crazy. Let's just put the door sensor right here. And I think I'm going to change that to the same color as this. So no one notices it. So automatically open. Um, I do need a couple more posters and stuff. Maybe, like, a rug in here. Ooh, just... Oh my god, that looks nice. for the market ah. what well, if i made it concrete <laughs> i'm just kidding although it wouldn't be too bad because concrete is for the ground anyway i can make it darker i want to make everything darker but when you think about a market you think about like bright stuff right don't you think about bright stuff this is a thousand times i'm changing the color of everything <laughs> okay i think we're good okay this is my supermarket I spent an hour on this. I don't know why it took me that long, but uh, let's see. Let's go over here. Okay, so supermarket looks pretty great. I need to make, um, I'm gonna make my own custom sign for the supermarket as well. So yeah, this is what it looks like, guys. This is what it looks like. We're gonna add some more foods over here. These are the essentials. There's a bunch of fruit here. It's wonderful, isn't it? And then over inside these freezers, I'm gonna put like fake frozen foods and stuff. So. Maybe we can search up something right now, actually, like frozen food. Fro okay, not actual frozen. What about food? How about food? Can I just, like, put food? 
<laughs> um, store food. How about, um, shelf food? <laughs> oh, I think this could work, right? Like, <laughs> how's this gonna look? <laughs> Stop it. Stop it. Okay, you know what? We'll fix that later. We'll fix that later. Anyway, that is my store, guys. This is how it's gonna look. And yeah. So I hope you enjoyed this belt. Okay, I'm gonna go hide in my I'm gonna hide in my little thing. Alright, close the Okay, we're gonna we're gonna do our outro here. <laughs> well anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed this um market build, I guess. A market. It's kinda like like I said, it's kind of like a Walgreens or something. It has kind of a bit of necessities and food but yeah if you enjoyed this video make sure to give it a big old thumbs up and if you want to continue watching any other roblox videos on the channel make sure to hit the subscribe button if you haven't already it is completely free and you'll be notified of when i upload thank you guys for taking the time out of your day to watch this i'll talk to you guys in the next upcoming video so stay tuned stay awesome have a wonderful day peter bread signing out goodbye everybody